William Gray is an NCANT student and works in a lab learning about automation. We have a lot of research going and a lot of involvement from a, a lot of departments. Uh, so to be able to show that off to actual astronauts and the governor, it just shows our ability and how advanced we are as a college. And it's not the first time NCANT has done that. Chancellor Harold Martin Sr. says they've sent numerous Aggies to NASA. Our relationship with NASA goes back many, many, many years. So today, NASA's Christina Koch, who set the record of the longest space flight by a woman and attended North Carolina State University in Raleigh, shared a special place she saw while in space. To try and make it feel like it felt for me that day, I want to show you something. It was North Carolina, this place that we all call home. Public schools in North Carolina were formative for her, moving up from middle school in Jacksonville to North Carolina State. It's why Cooper says the state needs to invest in public schools when he rolls out a budget to the North Carolina State Assembly tomorrow. And if we want to continue being first in business, we got to invest in our people. Reporting from Greensboro, Phil Sterling, ABC 45 News, standing up for you.